Hey everyone, Tommy Gibbons here, professor of the course. Looking forward to working with you through Paul's letter to the Romans. This is one of my favorite classes to teach at Fuller because it's rare that we get the opportunity to work carefully and methodically through one book of the Bible. So other courses that I teach at Fuller often require us to cover what feels like an overwhelming kind of expanse of the Bible or range of questions in one quarter. And while Romans is a long letter, at least it's only one book of the Bible. So looking forward to studying Romans carefully with you. For those of you who don't know me personally yet, I've been teaching at Fuller since 2010. So quite a while I teach in New Testament as well as Christian ethics I teach at the master's level, also at the PhD level here at Fuller, and I also have the opportunity to teach in both our English language programs and our Spanish language programs. So those are some of the kind of influences from different spaces at Fuller that I bring to the course. I am part of Knox Presbyterian Church which is here in Pasadena and have been a part of that church since 2011. My wife has been an elder there. Uh, we've been really involved uh, from uh, when we first started in various uh, parts of the community from teaching to different committees, sustainability, um, a missions uh, committee that my wife has chaired. So uh, lots of love for our local church community here. We have four children, uh, my wife and I together. Um, they are uh, a couple of them still at home, a couple of them moving on. They're 23, 20, 18, and 12. And so uh, maybe I'll throw some pictures up of at least Kim and me. Um, if not a couple of them. And uh, what else could I tell you just as a way to get the conversation going? I guess just to say that um, I approach the the New Testament um, with the expectation that we will hear uh, from God as we study the letter together and consider its um, teaching for our life. It's a demanding letter. You'll find that there's uh, plenty of uh, challenging reading in this course because I think interpreting the letter requires us to deal with a range of theological, philosophical, ethical questions that will impinge on our interpretation of the letter. And that's a kind of passion of mine is to uh, read here the New Testament in a way that uh, sensitizes us to the voice of God in our life through its words, through one another. And so I look forward to that experience with you. Uh, looking forward to the conversation and to seeing uh, your introductions uh, in the introduction forum uh, in the first week of the course.